Most people in America are quite familiar with how much a sandwich should cost and what the value should be within it. Today, I asked for some honey at Starbucks like I always do to add to my sandwich. In order to find myself some opportunity to produce a little bit more moisture sandwich, I brought over a sauce that I had in my pouch that I purchased about an hour ago. I opened my sandwich to find it was next to nothing in my sandwich. What I have felt about this shift of women is that they're always playing some sort of game. I do my best to be polite. I do my best to not stay inside the restaurant. I do my best to put my food money back into a company that is supposed to be protecting my investment. But this is what I received. This image is the food I received. Basically next to no chicken in a sandwich. Does that mean someone is shorting the food and not providing people appropriate amount of ounces of chicken in a sandwich? Does that mean an associate is eating some of the food that is being served to people like me? But what does that mean exactly for me that I just spent eight bucks on a sandwich that looks like this? I'm a little bit miffed off. If I walk in and try to communicate the complaint that I have about the lack of food in my sandwich, they'll probably play at me that I did something or I took something or I ate something and I've lied about it. And that's what people do to people who are indigent or people who are not openly on top of things all the time. The liars of a community are always liars. They always act really fancy, they act really nice, but then at the end of the day, they're pissing on your rights. A $8 sandwich should have plenty of meat within it, don't you think?